Good morning, everyone. It is 11:11, 11, 11, and as you can see, I am dressed up, and my hair is done because I was going to go to church today. Like I went to the church, but when I got there, I felt uncomfortable, so I left. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but yeah, I just didn't feel comfortable there. So I just went to Walmart, got some food stuff. Um, also got some workout clothes and a scale because I need a scale. And then I stopped by Wendy's and just got something to eat. So I need to figure out what's going on with my printer because for some reason it's just not printing correctly. Um, the ink is fine because I just put brand new ink in there. But for some reason, like, It'll print in color, but it won't print in black. Like the black ink won't print, and like that's the stuff that I need printed. Because if not, I'm gonna have to go to the library. The library doesn't open until 1:30. Um, because I need to go register my car, and I like to have the form filled out already. And I was planning on doing that tomorrow. <laughs> um, I think. I may go recycle today because I have all those boxes I need to put up. That way I could go to the other place to walk because I prefer the place next to the library. There's no recycling there. So I may do that after I eat. And that is about it for today. <laughs> um, I didn't vlog yesterday because I didn't do anything except wash my hair and then I just braided it. So now I have it in a braid out. Yeah, so I will talk to you guys later. Good morning everyone, it's like 8.45 right now. So I got up early, I have to go walking and to recycle. I actually set my alarm for 7. And I did that, I already did my leg toning exercise and took a shower and everything. <clears throat> and I'm just wearing this shirt, it's like a business in the front, but then party in the back <laughs> and I think I got this from the PX when I was in Germany and I'm just wearing some khaki type shorts and I think I'm gonna just wear my sandal and I just put my hair back in a ponytail and use some of the curls control paste to smooth down my edges and I need to go to the tax commissioner office so I can register my vehicle here after that I think um, I'll go to the post office and maybe to my storage unit to get another bag of clothes maybe Marshalls or somewhere because I keep forgetting to get a robe and I need to pick up something to hold um, my DVDs because on the TV rack, if I just set them up, they're going to basically fall over. So I need something to put on the ends because I'm going to put my DVDs down there on the bottom shelf. And I think that may be it for today. Uh, yesterday I did go online and order some stuff from art.com, just two pieces. And they were actually having a sell, but it ended yesterday, so that was fortuitous. <laughs> um, whenever they arrive, I'll show you guys what they are. Uh, so I'm thinking about putting the one on this wall, maybe, and maybe with something over the desk, and something in my bedroom, because I do have this print that I need to get framed. Um, it's been in a tube since I got it in 2012. <laughs> Because uh, I was the designated undergrad and they presented me with this picture. And it was in a frame when they presented it, but obviously they just took it out the frame and gave it to me in the tube. And it's been in there since 2012. So I need to find... Uh, I may do that today. i uh, go to the frame place, because I found one online, and get it framed. So that is the plan for today, and I will check back with you guys later. 
Okay, so it's like 10, 24 right now, and I am so annoyed right now. So I just came back from the tax office. I don't have plates yet because they said that um, my insurance policy has to be for here. Cause it's still for New York, obviously, because that's where my vehicle is registered. Then it's like they can't issue plates until I have insurance for this state. So I called, well, okay, I talked to the people at USAA the other day because that changed my address. Just like, they can't change my policy until New York gets their place. I'm like, how am I, that doesn't make any sense. Like, <laughs> I can't drive around without place, so, I don't know. <laughs> but he was saying that um, if I was to drop the policy earlier, it would, they would find me, basically. But if I could turn the plates in and make sure that it's registered mail or certified mail, then they will uh, destroy the plates the day that the policy ends so they shouldn't find me. So they changed my policy and the tax place is like right next to the library. So I went there to see if I could print it off and the computer's not working. Like seriously. <laughs> if it's not one thing, it's another. Um, so I'm just waiting for my computer to boot up. So I could print that, and also I forgot to take my print with me, so I could go get it framed. And I'm also about to eat the breakfast because I didn't eat anything yet. So I need to print off my policy. I don't even know if there's a fee or not because they don't take debit cards, and I don't have checks, so I would have to get like a money order or have cash on me. But I don't. I have no idea. <coughs> so. Hopefully I can get back before the lunch crowd gets there because I'm quite sure <clears throat> it was already a line when I was there the first time and I had to go basically get scanned and everything before they let you in. And I had my screwdriver in my purse, I completely forgot. <laughs> but I guess they didn't notice it or I don't know, but yeah. <sighs> so I'm about to eat some cereal, drink some water. <clears throat> print off my policy and then drive back. I'm going to see if there's like an ATM somewhere I can stop by so I can get some cash just in case I have to pay anything. Uh, but I don't know. So I will talk to you guys later. Okay everyone, it's 2.42 right now and I just got back. I didn't even go to Marshall's or the frame place. I was at the tax place the whole time. <laughs> just nonsense. Like, because they tell you one thing, and you go and do that, and then they come back and be like, oh, you need to do something else. I'm like, can't you just tell me everything at once? Like, what's so hard about that? I don't understand. <laughs> so when I got there, I was like, you know, I had my uh, insurance that I printed off. So I went there, and she was like, okay, you need to pay this fee, which the other person didn't tell me, like, almost 600 something dollars. I didn't even pay all of that. I just paid half. So I still have to pay the other half. <laughs> And she was like, oh, we can't accept insurance cards. It has to be electronic. So I called USA. I was like, they need an electronic copy. The guy was like, they already did that. It just takes a while for them to show. So I went back with the money and paid. I was like, they said they already did it. She checked. It was like not in the system. So I left. Sat in my car for maybe about 30, 45 minutes. Went back inside. And she was like, still not here, called USA again, and this person was like, oh, I'm going to put it in it right now, and it takes up to 15 minutes. I'm like, the person said they already did it, I don't understand what's going on. <laughs> so, yeah, so I'm about to eat something right now because I'm starving, and then, uh, oh, my screwdriver didn't fit, it's like too big on my plate, so I need to find something else. Um, <laughs> I do have this set, so hopefully one of these will fit, and I can take that off because I need to mail the tag today. And the storage place is like, I have to drive past the storage place to get to the post office, so I may stop and get a bag of clothes, so now I can come back and wash them or whatever. So I'm going to do that, and that is going to be it for today because I am tired. <laughs> um, I'm going to just go to Marshalls or wherever tomorrow and get 
and go to the frame place tomorrow as well. So that's going to be it for today and I will see you guys later. Good morning everyone. So it's like 7.40 right now and I'm about to go and work out. So this is one of the new tops that I got from Walmart, like $7.00. And have my belt on, headband, got my towel, and I think I'm going to go to the one by the library. I haven't been there in a while. And see, there's not really anything I need to do today, but um, for uh, we have to do... For my school, we have to do this, like, these courses, one on, I guess, alcohol, and the other one on sexual assault stuff. And for some reason, I can't do it on my computer, because I don't have a real laptop, I have a netbook. So the screen is smaller, and it won't let me do it on my laptop. So I'm going to have to go to the library and do that. Um, I'll probably just go ahead and do that today and get it out the way. It's not due until like August something. But I don't have anything else to do. <clears throat> so, anyway, so we get paid next week. And I'm hoping somebody will have like a 4th of July furniture sale or something. Because um, normally they seem to have sales during uh, those types of holidays. Like Veterans Day, Memorial Day, Labor Day. So, I'll probably wait and see if there's a sale going on and check out some places here in town. Um, but, that is it. I think I'm, I'm going to have to use my GPS because I'm not sure how to get there yet. Um, I think I do know how to get to the main library, like where I went yesterday by the tax office. I was able to get back without using a GPS. So, um, I'm going to see if I can get back here without a GPS when I get there tomorrow, today. We'll see. And also, I need to call and see about seeing someone um, at the closest uh, medical treatment facility or whatever. I don't know. I don't know how that works since I don't think they have like any of my records or anything, but... Since technically I'm still on active duty, I can't really go to the VA unless it's like an emergency and it's not an emergency. So, I'm going to have to call them to see what I'm supposed to do. I don't know. They didn't really say much what you're supposed to do when you're on transition leave and you need to go see someone. So, <laughs> I don't know. But that is it for now. I will talk to you guys later. Alright, so it's like uh, 11.30 and back from the library. Uh, I didn't get a chance to finish um, what I needed to do. I only had like an hour on the session and I had like three more sections to do. But I started having really bad cramps and I'm like, I can't take it, I have to leave. <laughs> uh, but before I left, I got this book lit by Mary Carr. Um, I saw someone do a review on it. I think it's like a trilogy or something, but memoirs. And I think this is the last one. And this one seemed the most interesting. So, um, I'll probably go back tomorrow. Um, well, that branch actually is closed tomorrow, so I'd have to go to the other one. One of the other ones and to finish that. And then we have another thing that we have to do in October. But anyway, so that is basically going to be it for today. I'm going to just do some laundry, lay down, <laughs> and read. And um, I had my hair braided. And I wore it braided um, when I went walking. And then I just unbraided it before I left. But that's it for today. I will see you guys tomorrow. Good morning everyone. It's like 8.20 right now and I just got back from walking um, and it's actually like perfect outside to work out because it's all overcast and cloudy. 
so it wasn't that hot, <laughs> which is good. <laughs> and so it might rain later. Um, for some reason, though, it's only been raining in like late afternoons and the evenings here. And so I'm about to do my leg workout, then take a shower and eat breakfast. And well, that's probably not going to take that long because <laughs> the library doesn't open until 10. So I'm going to go back to the library, finish that little course that I have to do, and check out some books. And then I may stop by the fresh market to get some fresh fruit and vegetables because I only have frozen. And then today I'll probably just come back and clean. And that's it. <laughs> I'll maybe go to the post office, check my P.O. box, and that's it, really. And I still didn't call to find out about this prescription, so I'll need to figure that out. I tried to go on TRICARE online yesterday, but for some reason the website wasn't working. So, we'll see if the website's working today. If not, then I'll just call. <clears throat> but that is it for now. I'll talk to you guys later. Alright, so I'm about to head out, go to the post office first, then the library, Target, and the Fresh Market. So I'm just wearing this tank top that I got from Hollister, and these plaid shorts that I got from Aeropostal. And I'm just going to be wearing my Spiri. So it's still kind of um, overcast and cloudy. So I'm going to just bring my umbrella just in case it starts raining. Um, I believe the stuff that I ordered from art.com should be arriving like tomorrow or Friday. And I did see a commercial for some furniture store that says they're having a 4th of July sale. So thinking on the 1st, I'm probably going to check out some furniture stores and stuff. At least want to get one piece of either a couch or a bookcase. Um, I'm thinking instead of getting dresser, a dresser, I might just get some plastic containers, like the big ones, and stack them on top, and that'll work the same as a dresser. And it's cheaper. <laughs> so, uh, uh, that is it for now. I will see you guys later. Alright everyone, it's like 12, 10 right now and I've been back for maybe 40 minutes. I was watching some YouTube videos but I just finished cleaning. So now all I need to do is vacuum and wash my bedding and stuff. Um, <clears throat> I didn't do everything I was going to do. I finished the courses and I'll just have to wait until October when they email us the link to do the second part. Um, I didn't go to Target or the Fresh Market. I forgot to bring my reusable bag and I'm like I'll just go tomorrow so I was at the library I could not find the book drop like it was nowhere to be found I'm like you would think there would be something outside or when you first walk in by the circulation desk but there was nothing um so I need to go back to the library tomorrow to return some books and I have a list of other books that I want to check out I've been trying to um read some classics because I feel like I didn't really read any in middle or high school. Like, I remember reading The Scarlet Letter and we read a lot of like Greek and Roman mythology. But uh, there's a lot of classics that we didn't read. So I've been um, reading some of those, like hard copy books, but also electronic books because what is it, Kindle and iBooks, um, some of those books are free basically. So. I've been reading some of those. So right now I'm just waiting for my food to finish warming up. It's just pasta with Alfredo sauce. And after I eat that, I'm going to vacuum, do laundry. Um, and I think that is going to be it for today. Yeah, <laughs> nothing else is going on. I should have taken summer classes. <laughs> My advisor asked me and I was like, 
no, because you know, I was thinking I went on a vacation, but now I'm like, I could have at least uh, taken classes in July because I still would have had like a whole month off. But now I still have like <laughs> almost two months left of doing nothing, <laughs> basically. That's so boring. <laughs> Cause I don't think I'll be traveling this summer. Um, yeah. So, I just need to, I guess, look online at some furniture. See if anybody else is having like a 4th of July sound. Start planning. I probably won't have everything, like my whole apartment set up. Maybe till September, I'm thinking. So that's probably when I do it, an updated apartment tour. So everything should be set how I want it. Hopefully that's the plan. <clears throat> but I <clears throat> also need to print off my schedule and stuff. And yeah. So I have the uh, the Bird Bees candle. And I'm not so sure sure about the smell anymore, like it smells good when it's not lit, but when you light it, you can't really smell anything, really. Mm -hmm. I don't know. So the other one that I got from Marshall, that one smells really good. So, and it was cheap. We're such a big candle. <clears throat> but that is it for today. I'm about to eat some lunch. And watch some more YouTube videos. And read some books. And that's it for today, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. It is like 9.15 right now. And I didn't go walk in this morning because I didn't sleep well. Like, I was having really bad stomach pain. It wasn't cramps. It was just like, I don't know what it was. But I decided to not go walking today. <clears throat> so I'm getting ready to go to the Fresh Market. And then just to drop those books off at the library. And that's going to be about it, I think. <laughs> so it was uh, storming yesterday, so I think it cooled down just a little bit. Not much, but anything's better than what it was. Um, I'm probably not going to check out any books today because I still have the other one I need to finish reading. And I have some ebook that I want to read also. So last night, um, instead of braiding my hair, I twisted it to big twist because it was just quicker. And yeah. So I think maybe this weekend I might actually just do some twists. So I thought about, you know, like unbraiding or untwisting my hair and then retwisting it at night. Just leave it in some twists. So right now I'm just wearing this I Heart Hanson shirt. <laughs> Guys, um, I actually saw them in concert twice and once I won a meet and greet with them because uh, I was a member of their fan club and I'm surprised I actually won a meet and greet. I didn't think I would. <clears throat> That's one thing I can't wait to do is like go start seeing concerts again. I don't really have anything planned for today. Um, I need to check my uh, army email. Uh, I have a CAC reader, so I need to plug that in because I haven't checked it since I left. I think like maybe the 10th. Because I didn't have time on the 8th to check anything. So I'm thinking I have a ton of email. And then I almost forgot that I still need to do my travel voucher. I mean, they're not going to pay me until my ETF state. But I almost forgot that I need to do that. So I'm probably going to wait until it's closer because there's no point in doing it right now. But that's some money that I can be looking forward to. It's going to come like right after my ETF state, right before classes start. But that's after tax free weekend and I wanted to get my school supply during that weekend. Um, I'm gonna get most of everything. Um, I'm gonna wait to get my uh, laptop. 
I'm gonna need a new one. I can't use that netbook for classes. Cause three of my classes are online and yeah, that it's causing way too much problem. So I'm just about to head out right now. Luckily the fresh market opens at nine. Um, hopefully there's a drop off for the book somewhere and I just didn't see it yesterday. <laughs> there has to be one. <laughs> So, I will see you guys later. Alright, so I am back. I didn't go to the library. Um, I just went to the Fresh Market and I did stop and look at Target to see how much the robes are. And they were like $24. I'm like, I'm not spending $24 on a robe. Okay. <laughs> so, from the Fresh Market, uh, I just got like a bottle of water. Um, some organic bananas, some more milk, and some organic blueberry, some cherries, strawberries, coconut water. And um, I got the Fresh Market brand because it was cheap, the cheapest one. And some more spinach and kale. The only thing I don't like about organic stuff is that they tend to expire quickly. So, um, and all of that with taxes and everything is like $39, $39.75. Yeah, organic stuff is expensive. <laughs> oh no, the cherries were expensive. What the heck? Oh my goodness. <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. I need to be double checking the stuff. like the prices and making sure that they're charging me correctly because that seems necessary. <laughs> I'm not going to say how much they cost, but yeah. <laughs> There's no way that little bag can cost that much. Oh my goodness. Okay. So, um, I didn't eat anything yet, so I'm about to buy something to eat and Check my email. And that's what I'm guessing. Um, <laughs> wow. This is so boring. Um, yeah, I really have nothing to do. So, I will see you guys. Tomorrow, I guess, unless something exciting and interesting happens, but I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good afternoon, everyone. It's like 12 o'clock on the dot, and I just got back. I went to the library and also stopped by Chick-fil-A because I wanted some waffle fries <laughs> and a lemonade. Um, so I got five books to read. Uh, two of them are about education, and then the other three are just like, I guess, classic books. Um, so I didn't go walking this morning, because I don't know why, but I'm still having like pain in my abdomen. And I have no idea what it's from or whatever. Uh, so I did wake up though, like around 7. I just laid in my bed for like two hours. I was about to doze, like I started dozing off around 9 something and then the maintenance people walk, uh, was banging on my door because I put in a request for them to fix my air conditioner which they did and I'm guessing they were here when the post 
I guess it was the postman. I don't know if it was UPS or just regular mail, but this was inside my apartment, so I'm guessing the maintenance people were still here when it arrived. So, I got my two art pieces. You guys will be seeing that whenever I do my updated apartment tour, probably in September. <laughs> um, so I have nothing else planned for today. I'm going to try not to read, because I could probably read all those books in two days, but I'm going to try not to do that because I literally have nothing else planned. And the library is going to be closed next Friday and Saturday for 4th of July. So <clears throat> I'll probably go back on Thursday and check out some more books. Um, but tomorrow I'm just going to be washing my hair. I don't know how I'm going to style it yet. Um, Sunday I'm going to go to a different church and check that one out. Um, I've been trying to find non-denominational churches just because that's what I'm more comfortable with. But one of them I was looking at that I originally was planning to go to was uh, Methodist or something like that. I don't know. So I'm thinking next week is going to be just as boring because I have nothing planned next week. Even though it's the 4th of July weekend, yeah, I have no plans. Um, although we do get paid next week, so I already saw a bookcase that I wanted to get, um, from walmart.com, and I'll probably also order, like, two bar stools, and then the follow paycheck is when I get my couch, and I think actually for the most part that's all the furniture, well, that's all the furniture for this area. I still need to get light. I'm gonna get a side table for my room and I don't know, maybe dressers or some containers. And I can figure out what's going on with my bed situation because I'm still using the air mattress. Um, so that really is it. That's gonna be the end of this week's vlog. Thank you for watching and following me along on my boring week. I really wish that I had signed up for summer classes. <laughs> yeah. Starting to get cabin fever. <laughs> besides school, I'm guessing the only other place to meet people would be like church or something. I don't know. Because I don't go to clubs or stuff like that. I don't drink. So, hopefully this church I go to this Sunday will be good. <laughs> but I will see you guys next week. Thanks for watching.